1939, David Packard and Bill Hewlett made the first computer called the Hewlett Packard. The first product that they made was the 200A audio oscillator. The oscillator became popular pretty fast by being a piece of test equipment to the engineers. In 1941, the British people made a computer called the Bombay. The Bombay was built for gathering and processing capabilities of Allied forces. In 1943, the computers continued to help the military by building flight simulations and testing guns. On December 23, 1947, William Shockley, Walter Bertain, and John Bardeen successfully tested a point contact transistor, setting off the semiconductor revolution. Models of the transistor were improved at the AT&T Bell Laboratories, supplanting vacuum tubes used on computers at the time. In 1948, IBM came out with the first calculator. The calculator wasn't the size they are now. This calculator was 25 feet by 40 feet. It computed scientific data in public display near the Manhattan headquarters. 19 years later, it planned Apollo's course to the moon. Later on down the road in 1953, Jay Forrester installed a magnetic core memory on the Worldwind computer. Five years later, in 1958, Jack Kilby made the first integrated circuit to prove the resistors and the capacitors could exist on the same piece of semiconductor material. The first mini computer was made in 1965 by the company IBM. The IBM mini computer was worth up to $18,000. In 1966, the first video game was designed by Ralph Barrett and the game was released in 1972. The game was called Pong. Pong resembles a game that is now known as Ping Pong. In 1971, the first personal computer was advertised for $750 in Scientific America. The computer was known as the Kimback One. The Kimback One had a 256 byte memory, however, they only sold 40 copies of the Kimback One personal computers. Steve Wozniak designed and made the Apple One. The computer was a single board computer and had specifications in hand in an order for 100 machi machines at $500 from the bike shop. Steve Wozniak and Steve Jobs started their own business and 200 machines sold before the company announced the Apple II as the first complete computer. In 1981, Adam Osborne made the first portable computer called the Osborne One. It weighed 24 pounds and cost $1,795. The computer had a 5 inch display with 64 kilobytes of memory, a modem, and two 5 and a quarter inch floppy disk drives. Three years later, Apple came out with a new computer called the Lisa. The Lisa was the first personal computer with a graphical interface. Apple set the price of the Lisa so high that it was considered a failure. The price was $10,000. In 1991, the Linux operating system came out. The Linux was designed by Linus Torvalds. Linus was a Finnish university student. The Linux was released to many Usenet news groups on September 17th. Enthusiasts began improving the Linux by adding support for peripherals and improving its stability. The Linux is now one of many open sources Unix-like operating systems.